Good morning, my farm friends. I am Melody Segeheis, or Gigi, Gigi Ma, if that's okay with you guys. Um, my last video, I showed you guys the littlest people on our farm. Now let me show you the biggest ones. Hang on, just one second. There she is. This is Mocha. She is one of our our cows. We do have two. And right there is the other one. That is Moon. There are t they are two little heifers that we have. They are both um, two years old. We have raised them from baby babies. Now, they are very small, as you can tell. But that's because they are Jersey cows. They're little cows. But we have two female cows. Now, they are in the winter digs right now. They are in, um, in a small paddock connected to the barn. So, in the springtime, they will be going into a much, much bigger place. Won't you? Yes, you will. You'll be going into a much bigger um, paddock. And But for the wintertime, we want them close by and warm. We do... Um, live out in the middle of the woods and there are coyotes and other things that run around here so we want to make sure that they are um well protected here in the barn it does make for kind of a messy place but spring's coming and they'll go out into a much bigger pasture and be much happier but those are the two of our biggest animals now let me bring you over here to show you the next biggest or um our little pride and joy if you want to know the truth are you guys ready i'm flipping you around okay do you see these guys these are our female goats there the one right there is darlin and right there is Star. And this one down here is the newest member of our goat herd. This is Little Miss Blaze. She is our very first born uh, baby goat on our farm. Isn't she just the cutest little thing? Oh my goodness she is just a little bit over a month old and again the goats are in um their winter uh paddock it's just behind our woodshed we have it set up with heating lamps and everything for the little girl oh she's eating a leaf look at it she is so cute hi mama hi baby Yep, this is the mama one. Um, we thought both were going to, to kid this year, but nope, just the one. So we have two females as of right now. Um, we will be getting two more milking um, goats come springtime. Um, we thought when we bought these two, we got them as kids. And we bought two males and two females with the hopes of, um, sorry for looking down all the time. I don't want to fall, so I'm just kind of being a little careful here. But with the hopes of, you know, growing a herd, which is happening. But what we didn't know is that the two goats that we bought were actually meat goats, not milk goats. So, um, they, we can milk them, don't get me wrong, but, um, we will be getting two, either Nigerian or, um, Nubian females in the spring as kids, and we'll raise them up. Now, you want to know why Little Miss Blaze is so dark? Let me show you. That right there is our Billy. This is Elvis. Hi, Elvis. What you doing, Bob? 
Yeah, that's my that's our big old boy Elvis, and he is our baby daddy. Well, actually, to be honest, he's not Blaze's daddy. We had two goats just like him. We had another goat named Bo. Well, the two of them kept fighting so dang much that we decided that Bo had to go. So, um, we only have Elvis now. So, but Bo was actually, um, Blaze's daddy. Yeah, look at that big boy. He's such a beautiful boy. Yes, he is. So, the, those are our bigger animals. We have the four goats and the two cows. And now, we also have quite a few birds and quite a few kitty cats running around. Now, somebody made a comment um, a while, uh, on my last video about the pictures on the um, intro video. And asked if our dogs were um, uh, golden retrievers or Irish stutters. Um, those pictures are from a coloring book app, and just depict the dog. It, it our none of our dogs look like that picture. And actually, I think only one of our cats looks like the picture that I chose. They're just representations of the animals that we have. Um, just uh, to make the uh, video. But uh, right now, let me walk on over here. I'm trying to be kind of taking it slow, guys, because I don't want to fall. I'm heading to uh, our side yard here to the um, chicken and duck pen. Okay, I'm almost there. I'm going to flip around. There they are. Um, we have, at the moment, right there, see that big boy right there? That right there is our crazy boy. That's Rocket. Rocket is king of the roost here because all the other he is the only rooster here And he thinks he's all that in a bag of chips too guys to be honest um, He has nine females all to himself and he is a happy happy boy about it now We will be changing this this whole thing up Pretty soon. Um, it is a mess right now. Uh, we will be fixing it up a little bit better. This was a um, just a put together. We're going to be fixing it up this spring much, much better. But they everybody's gotten through the winter. It's just that uh, it's quite the mess. Now, if you look over there, there are two Peking ducks. Who are uh, King P and Queen Peep Peep. And then there are three female rowans. Now we had two male rowans. But oh my goodness you guys. I have never known two more randy ducks in my entire life. They would try to mate with everything. Including the chickens. Well, uh, we, they nearly drowned a couple of our other, du a couple ducks, um, and a couple chickens, so we, um, they're in our freezer now. But if you notice, there's some chickens in there. Now, I didn't mention the, these guys, oh, there goes a squirrel, see it? Bye-bye, squirrel. Um... Yeah, because we feed the ducks and chickens in here, the squirrels are fat and sassy around here. They really are. They come in and clean up what the others don't eat. <laughs> but um, there are five bantam chickens here as well. Um, honestly, I don't know what's a hen and what's a rooster on these guys. They're just the bantam pack. Um, 
there are five of them, and we do believe there might be a sixth one. We got six at first. And sorry about that, guys. Um, somebody decided to give me a scare, and I accidentally hit the wrong button. He jumped at the fence at me. <laughs> he he kind of um, jumped at the fence behind me, and it kind of startled me. Yeah, he thinks he's all that. He does, he does. But as I was saying, um, we have... We started out with six phantoms. Oh, I got to show you somebody. That right there is Missy. Missed you. She is one of our barn cats. She is a sweetheart. Um, and her brother's running around here somewhere. And then she's got some nieces and nephews running around here too. But, um... As far as the bantams go, this is what happened. Our neighbor has a um, has a flock of, of chickens and ducks as well, and um, another neighbor's dogs came and destroyed them. Uh, all but one, actually, Rocket is the only one that survived. Well. The neighbor that had the dogs, um, tried to make up for it by giving her the, the six bantams. Oh, he jump off? Oh, yeah. <laughs> we have somebody, uh, one of the cats is on, uh, we had company come to see my granddaughter and one of the cats is sitting on her the roof of her car <laughs> she's like will it jump off yeah it'll jump off okay um what I, where was i oh yeah um the uh neighbor gave her a bunch of bantam chickens to make up for it well they needed bigger chickens so we had had a uh clutch of chicks hatch so we traded her our chicks for the bantams well when we first traded we had um there were six of them uh one of them decided to go elsewhere hey get your butt hang i'll be right back okay i'm back um our Guard dog, um, Skinnerd, Leonard Skinner decided to, uh, say hello to the ladies that were just leaving. So, I uh, had to kind of wrangle him up a little bit. Now, as I was saying, the, uh, we had one bantam that kind of decided it was going to be wild and has taken off on us. Every once in a while we see it, we just don't know where it is. Now. Right here is the last of our birds. Let me to show you what we got. We have three peacocks. One white and two blue. Um, they are still very young yet, so we don't know if one, which ones are boys and girls yet. But they are the peacock gang here. We have, um, and they are in their winter digs too. We will be, if I turn this way, there is a large pen right there. And that is going to be theirs when, sorry about that, hit the wrong button. Yeah, that pen right there will be theirs when they get a little bit bigger. Um, I have all kinds of puppy dogs and kitty cats to show you. But, um not sure which ones we have out here so but we have several barn cats and we have seven dogs um we have uh i have three dogs and i will show them to you as soon as i get in the house okay and then my grandson has a pit bull and he's the one that i just said you know was talking about and then my daughter has 
Um, three as well. She has a tiny, teeny, tiny chihuahua and a beagle mix named Nova and a larger chihuahua named Blitz. So, but they are down in their trailer. And my daughter, although she is very supportive of my channel, she doesn't want me to film in her trailer. And I can't blame her. You know, that's their private spot. So I stay, don't, uh, I don't do that. You know what I mean? All right, I'm going to go in and then I will introduce you all to my doggies. Okay. Okay, guys. Well, let me introduce two of our doggies. Well, actually, three of our doggies. This little lady right here is almost 15 years old. This right here is Medjay. Medjewedjay. Yeah, she's our old girl. And this right here, you've seen her in one of my other videos. This is Marley. This is Midget's granddaughter. They are Chihuahuas, kind of ch um, miniature Chihuahua. And well, Marley is a miniature Chihuahua and Wiener Dog. And Midget is Chihuahua and Wiener Dog. And the big boy on the floor over here, this big old boy, right here. Is Nico. Yep, better tail. That's Nico. He is our indoor guard dog. Yes, he is. This is Mama's big baby. And he is... I'm trying to... I'm right here. Sorry about that. He is four years old, I think. And he, he protects the inside while Skinner protects the outside. And we, and that is pretty much everybody, I'm pretty sure. Now, like I said, there are lots of kitty cats here. Uh, you got to see the kittens and Mama Cat. Well, Mama Cat has a twin sister. And then there is another set of twin kittens outside and that look just like mama cat and her sister and then there's missy who you saw or mischief and then she's got a brother named mittens and you'll see him sooner or later i just didn't see him out there so <laughs> and then we have our big our girl who is I don't know, um, 12, 13 years old. I can't remember how old she is, but she's a, her name is Chaos, and you'll see her around here sometime, too. So, there you go. You got to meet all the critters on our farm. Thank you for joining me today. Um, I hope you enjoyed that. I actually enjoyed getting outside a little bit today. Thank you for joining us. Have a terrific day. And we will see you again very, very soon. Bye now.